Oh, hey, that was a big day. But I'm glad to be back in the fish room. So let me have a shower and show you what's going on. Let's get it. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's better. Welcome back guys to the fish room. Uh, glad to have you back. It's um, been a pretty busy day, but shower, dress, change, feel heaps better. And I've got some cool news. We have some new fish um, currently in quarantine. And if you've tuned into the channel for a little bit, you'd know that I've kept very similar, actually no, identical fish to these. They're just pretty much just a different color. So what are they? They are the gold white cloud mountain minnows. Uh, super stoked. Um, couldn't help yourself going into the pet shop the other day, um, mainly for frozen foods to be honest and as we do we go through the have a look at what sort of fish they had and for the first time uh, I've seen in my local area they actually had gold white cloud mountain minnows. Um, as you know I already have the 150 litre tank behind me with 30 um, normal white clouds in it and I also have a little 40 litre tank that has um, a little small breeding colony in it. So, pretty stoked, couldn't help myself, had to grab them. Um, there are heaps of videos out there on um, caring for these guys, so if you are looking at it, um, go and check them out. They're a lot more in depth um, than the brief overview that I guess I'll give you. Um, awesome fish, um, temperate water, temperatures between 17 and 22 degrees C which is roughly 64 degrees to 72 degrees Fahrenheit, I believe, um, going off that. Um, they love rocky sort of substrate <coughs> with pebbles, cavey sort of things. So I ran with rocky substrate in the 150 for them guys and went with some driftwood and a lot of plants that actually grew a bit higher. So I was pretty stoked with that. The fish seem really happy and it gives them some place to hide. Um, the bonus with the white clouds is being a temperate water fish, you can get away with not needing a heater in the tank. One of my three tanks, well I guess if you count the quarantine tank as the third, um, are heated. Um, my fish room's in the house, um, in a back room, a reasonably small room, which is great because obviously all the outside walls are insulated. Um, I believe my internal walls are also insulated and my ceiling's insulated. So, um, super, super awesome. This room sits at about 20 degrees anyway, just normally. Um, so these guys are right in the ballpark there. Um, super peaceful fish. They love, um, food-wise, I feed my guys um, small pellets, um, flake food, um, and frozen foods. Uh, with the frozen foods, it's just generally just more of a community frozen food. Um, that you can get generic from um, pet shops. There are so many out there, so just look into um, fish foods and try all different ones and see which ones your fish like when you get them. Um, definitely go and read up. As I said, there's heaps of information about them. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys my five that I picked up and pretty excited. I do have three of the tanks, as I said. Um, so I reckon we're going to have to do a bit of shuffling here soon and there might be a new project. And I dare say that this 150 is going to end up being chockers and it's going to look amazing. So um, I will probably won't need to purchase any more. I reckon they're all going to come straight out of this room, which is kind of cool. So thanks guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's glad to catch up and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Cheers.